Hello and welcome to the show. Today I am going to be playing Stuntman, a game that uh, I haven't actually really played before. I remember having a demo for this and played the crap out of the demo but never actually played the full game. So I am really rather looking forward to actually giving this this game a try. I've heard many great things about it and I remember loving the demo, but yeah, I never I never got around to playing the full thing. This this game cost me 75p. That was it. <laughs> That's all it cost. So yeah, I have been, I've been looking forward to uh, to giving this one a go. Uh, we are going to do the the career mode. I literally loaded this up and then realised turning the music off actually turns off the voices for the cutscenes. So yeah. <laughs> That's, uh, that's a fun thing, but there we go. We're starting on a film, it's Toothless in Whopping. What an amazing name. And this is exactly what London looks like, everybody. Okay, that, that's just an exact representation of London for you right there. So this is where the truck's heading straight at me. Should be about 30. I'll be hitting about 60. If the truck clips me, it's anybody's guess where it spins me. So the idea is, as the name suggests, is you are the, the stuntman. For a film, it gives you lots of, if I remember correctly, sort of precision tasks that you've all got to do relatively quickly. So you might have to do chase something through a town, and the, like the director person will often shout at you and tell you to sort of bump into things or have near misses with stuff and so on. It's um, this yeah, quite an interesting concept. Comedy. Two hopeless small timers up against the police and gangland kingpin, the dentist. One of the leads, Vince, is trying to get across town for a pickup but he's already late. I'll have constant radio communication with the director for every stunt I do. Time to get on set. So, yeah, there we go, basically. Is, uh, I, I vaguely rem I remember the name. I remember the, the name to the whopping and remember this kind of um, film-esque loading screen. Quite what on earth it is going to... Oh, we're, we're in. We're, 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 we go. We're chasing the van, are we? Okay. Uh, where we, oh, I don't know what handbrake actually is. Um, <laughs> um, I, I'm not sure what the, the controls were there. Um, let's just have another go. It did shout handbrake at me. I don't know what handbrake is. It would be kind of... <laughs> this is not a problem normally faced by stuntmen. They normally know where the handbrake is. I don't know which button it might be. Um, oh, okay, that one there didn't work. Ah, right, okay, I found handbrake. Um, oh, my X button is dodgy as hell. Uh, I don't think I quite got... Okay, no, maybe I did. Okay, we're fine. Uh, the timer does count down in between the stunts. Right, it did count as a handbrake turn. Oh, that's really dark. <laughs> it just turned into the tunnel, suddenly pitch black. I've got to overtake something. I can't see anything. We've failed all of the stunts. Oh, uh, we're still going. We're still going. There's a gap there briefly. Okay, the gap's not there briefly. Let's maybe have another. I am not a very good stuntman, it turns out. Uh, <laughs> wow. Um, I imagine, uh, although I don't remember, this is probably going to be one of those RC difficult games to uh, to try and it's all complete. Oh, hello, car. Uh, oh, my X button is so dodgy on this controller. Right. Handbrake. There we go. That's the ticket. We did a stunt correctly. Oh, crap. The time is, is ticking down. Oh, Capri, don't end up in the wall. Right. Boxes. Got the boxes. Fantastic. Now, don't drive into the truck. There we go. That's the ticket. Right. Overtake him. Yes. There's a car coming that way. It's so dark down here. It's also a little bit difficult to control, but there we go. There's a gap there. Well, I found the tires at least. Smash some boxes! There's another another gap there. Oh, okay, it breaks quite powerful. More boxes! Ah, uh, uh, oh, what are we doing here exactly? Hey, we completed it! That was the scene that we needed to do, apparently. Uh, <laughs> the brakes are quite sharp. I may have grabbed the handbrake rather than brakes. I uh, got 85% accuracy. I will take it. We got paid 1,700 is it pounds. Or dollars. I didn't actually see the currency. Either way, we got paid 1,000 and something of it. So that's not bad for 30 seconds work. I may have crashed a couple of the other Capris, but uh, <laughs> never mind. Uh, right, we unlocked a new car. Oh, the arena. I remember this. You could set up all your own stunts. That was very good fun. Um, okay, let's see where we go to next. Britain, the cars are right-hand drive, so we get left-hand drives over from Europe and drive those. We'll actually control the cars with mini steering wheels we keep out of shot. 
Yeah, there's kind of all sorts of interesting sort of little little talky bits in between going through the the various. Ones. I don't know how accurate it is to the actual. I, I assume fairly, but uh, yeah, no idea uh, quite how accurate it is. Right, what challenges are you going to throw scene, at us today? Vince and Ray escape to the docks with the safe in the back of the car. I need to do a 180 turn here, then stop close to the jetty edge to make it look good. I sense a car going in the water. I'm going to try and not put the car in the water. I suspect, though, again, I'm assuming we're... Are we still in the Capri? It may get slightly damp because, uh, yeah... <laughs> There is a good possibility that I will uh, not quite get the timing correct. Either I'll stop nice and safely, or we or we won't stop nice and safely. Ooh, more boxes! Death to all of the boxes! That is the most important thing. Oh, that's quite a narrow gap. Never mind. We're through them. More, more death to boxes. That's a wall. I'm not a very good getaway driver. Oh, uh, oh, come on. Oh, I, need, I really need a better, uh, better controller for this one there. Oh, brakes and. Stop. Um, I'm not quite sure where we're going, but that didn't work. I found a lamppost. Okay, we're finding the scenery. Uh, we're through. The this, this is going to make like a ooh, um, an amazing, uh, amazing right. scene. Uh, ooh. Ah, oh no, things God, have gone wrong. Yes, again. it's definitely an amazing scene. <laughs> I, I, where was I going? I was going in the water. I said the Capri was going to go for a swim. What did you expect? Uh, <laughs> Okay, might have expected there to be a little bit more time, possibly just a smidge more time to sort that out. And um, apparently, apparently not. Yeah, I, I do kind of love how you don't have to be like a hundred percent perfect. You can get away a little bit with the odd bump on the wall. Oh, like that one there, for example. Make for the most amazing film scene. Just a Capri bumbling its way around London. Uh, right, and another bit of a handbrake. Oh, yeah, of course, of course. As a as a getaway driver, the first thing you've got to do is uh, oh. Uh, make sure you take out the doors of any vehicle you find around. Oh crap, that's not quite where we want to be going. Don't mind me. Fine, fine. Nothing very bad nearly happened. Brakes now. We've got to reverse. Let's look behind that. Let's look behind. Uh, forward. I don't think I quite got in the zone, but never mind. Um, break at the end. Hey, we did it. <laughs> <laughs> I could probably have made that a little bit more spectacular with the uh, with the parking, but I'll take it. Hey, got a hundred percent accuracy bonus and only sunk one Capri. I wonder how many cars will be destroyed in the making of this film by me. Well, <laughs> having having accidents. I do I do think I'm doing better though than I did when I played this first time around. Um, we got a new car. Okay, awesome. Uh, I like this. Oh, we got some barrels to uh, crash into in the arena. I like the rate that he's throwing cars at me so far. I think all of these cars are for uh, just for the arena because the career mode you kind of just give them whatever you need for the scene. So yeah there's quite a lot of fun to be had with the arena. I believe there are some driving challenges as well uh, for that you can you can probably pick whatever vehicle you want for. Now Vince and Ray ditch the safe and get chased by the police. For the finish I drive up and over a dumpster making sure I get enough speed into the jump to make a wreck of the car. Woo, I get to roll a car and it's on purpose this time. Even better, you have definitely employed the right person when you need a car to be rolled over. I mean, you don't even need to really give me a ramp, just give me a large curb and I'm sure I'll be able to uh, <laughs> to get the car to uh, to crash off it. Right, I seem to remember this game actually has a relatively decent damage model. Again, you know, this is a, a pretty old game. Uh, it did have a very, very good damage model for the time. One. Right, Up come the on journey. then, let's Hit see. The Oh, we've got to... Hey, there we go. Oh, there's a policeman there. Hello, Mr. Policeman. Are we going this way? No, Mr. Trash Cans. Sorry. Uh, oh, this is the way we're going. Oh, it's so dark. Uh, I'm assuming we're going this way. Uh, I could be wrong, though. I have really no idea. Where are we going exactly? Ah, there we are. Oh, I've beaten up a forklift. Uh, <laughs> wow. These games are so absurdly dark. Uh, <laughs> um... Yeah, well that's... Uh, okay, right. Hold on. Before we restart, I'm going to turn the brightness up on my TV massively. It's not a problem. I don't, don't even know how to do that on my TV. I've not done this for ages. You're not going to see any of this. Um, I can't say I've ever had to do this with any other game. Right, brightness up uh, to about there. I, I may may I might be saying this. I may well have had to boost the thing on the actual recording because that is absurdly, absurdly dark. Uh, <laughs> 
I have been having this problem a little bit with some of the some of the older games. I guess it's just the way that they were made, and it's possible I'm playing it on well a very modern TV, and uh, yeah, that might be uh, causing some problems. Right. Okay, now I have got a lovely bright screen. I shall hopefully not be getting so lost. Uh, right, there's the cans. We got the cans. Ooh, warehouse, come here. Ah, it's glorious. I can see where I'm going this time. Uh, oh, God. Ah, there's a forklift there. I remembered just about about you anyway. Ooh, another forklift. Bloody forklift's getting in the way. Ah, so much easier where you can see where you're going. Uh, ooh, a handbrake turn. I can do a handbrake turn around there. Where are you going to be sending me next game? We're going over here. Oh, roadworks! Yay, everyone loves crashing through roadworks. Um, oh, hello, policeman. We're fine. There's only a small bit of bumping there. Oh, we're overtaking a car. Yes, we've overtaken a car. Oh, crap. This is going to be a dangerous one. Oh, hello, van. I knew there was... Oh, we got beaten up by a curb, and then we got beaten up by all of the other vehicles. Oh, no. Quick, through the gap. We're running out of time! There's another gap! Oh no! <laughs> I made a wreck of the car, didn't I? It was a more natural crash than the sort that you would get from rolling off a dumpster, but there we go. Uh, <laughs> I got beaten by a curb. I had to mention them before setting up for this stunt. I, I really had to mention them. Um, yeah. Wow. Um, <laughs> okay, let's not, hopefully... Uh, get beaten up by a curb. Right, now I know where I'm going. I can uh, ooh, hopefully, hopefully fare better if I don't bugger up with this uh, with this controller. Ooh, there we go. That's the ticket. Out. Avoid the forklift. More handbrake turnings around here. Ooh, some more boxes can go bye-bye. Oh, look at this. We're doing so much better for time. Ooh, that's a big air time. Um, Houston, we have a small problem. I may have rolled slightly too early. You wanted me to roll the car, okay? It's just ended the scene a slightly different way. I don't know what's wrong with that. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how I did a roll. It was stuck on its side. I turned one way, it did nothing, turned the other way, and it fell onto its roof. Um, yeah, okay, right. Let's not do any really, really big wheelies over the ramps. I think that would probably be a good Up way to go, perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> right, that can get knocked out of the way. That can get hit. We can. I love how quickly they move. Look at the speed. They run so fast. <laughs> uh, right. Oh, we've scraped a container. Never mind. It is more authentic. Oh, I rolled a forklift. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'll take it. Uh, right, handbrake turn around uh, there. We will get out of the way of the policemen's. Right, roadwork destruction. Oh, my... Bloody, the X button is so dodgy on this controller. Uh, <laughs> we made it through the gap without uh, attacking the police car. Oh, stop going off full power, goddammit. Uh, okay, right, now this is where things went badly wrong last time. It was when we were trying to get across. There we go, we're across, we're across. Through the gap. There could be another gap there. And roll to finish. That was a good one. That was a good roll. I am pleased with that one. 95% accuracy. I'm not sure what. Uh, maybe I'll be scraping the wall, bugging it up. That was a good roll, though. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I will take that one as a, as a spectacular finish. Okay, what else are we going to have to be doing here? I don't know. Uh, hey, we got a van, uh, because uh, why not? What else have we got? A, uh, it looks like a kind of a flip ramp sort of a thing to be playing around with. Next stunt! We're still on this film. I mean, we've, we've had the big car chase and ruined the car. What on earth are you going to be getting us to be doing next? Are we going to... The, the Capri's done for, so I'm assuming you're going to give me something new, something interesting, possibly, to be playing around with, likely crashing into stuff. It tends to just be the way that, that things go when you give me cars in In this in a sequence, game. I drive a police car chasing one of the densest gangsters around warehouses. I need to stick close the whole time to make it look right. At the end of the stunt, I have to ram the lead car into the river. Oh, I get to be a policeman now. Fantastic. Okay, so we're giving chase. Again, I suspect we will be ordered to crash into some things, and another car goes swimming. They're going to be very busy fishing cars out of the the Thames by the time they're finished fil <laughs> filming this one. Now, how many cars? So we've got one Capri in, and we're technically we might have got... I don't know what car, we're, what car are between we chasing here. Uh, between the cars. Oh, we are chasing the, the Capri. So we've had one Capri in, hopefully a second one, and how many takes this is going to take, I don't know. Ooh! Frame rates, come on now. <laughs> oh, this thing does not feel particularly fast. 
Um, I could pit maneuver you right now, but I suspect I would get told off for failing the film. Oh, this controller is so, so dodgy. Uh, go, Hit go, go, police car. They're going for the barrels. Oh, no. Crap. Uh, I don't know if that scenery there is destructible the or not. Oh, we're into another warehouse. Into they the do like they're racing through the warehouses. Uh, what are we crashing into? Oh, more boxes. Woohoo! Death to them. boxes. Go on. Move. God, yeah, dear, you are a bad getaway driver as I am. Uh, oh, yay. We're breaking some more things. I'm assuming, yeah, we're not going to go th ooh, through a gap. I'm assuming we're not going to go through a van. So there we go. Ah, underneath that one. Uh, crash into car. I can do crash into car. I can do crash into car. I'd say that was a uh, <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good and a good crash at the end there. I was kind of half expecting me to go in with him, but no, we timed it perfectly. Fantastic. I wonder if there is a replay mode for watching back the, the finish. Oh, and I think there is. <gasps> when you finish the film, I th or when you finish the, if I seem to remember rightly from the demo, when you fin when you finish the, the the stunts for a film at the end, oh, there is a few replay there. To roll a car. There's a, a pipe ramp, literally driving the subframe up a pipe. There's also what we call a cannon roll, which we're going to do next. We make it look as if it's a collision that turns the car when, in fact, I got a button by the handbrake that shoots a pole out from under the chassis of the car when I slide the car sideways at exactly the right moment. And that'll flick me over. I just have to be sure to press it at the right time. As I was saying, before I got rudely interrupted, I think at the end of end of each film, it plays back the your chases and puts them all together in, in the right order. I think, again, if I remember rightly from the demo, I think that's what it does, and that, that will be quite cool. There was some, as I say, there was some half-decent manoeuvres, a couple of bumps along the way, but uh, <laughs> nothing too terrible. This one looks like we're going to be dealing with this a uh, split ramp. This is one of the scenes in the film, and here, I chase the dentist's white van. To complete the stunt, I cannon roll the car as the van rams me. If I mess up the timing, I'll wreck the car, but we won't be able to use the footage. All right, so yeah, we've got kind of like a split ramp and the the, the fiery cannon. I <laughs> I don't know what the action button is going to be for fire. I'm going to guess at triangle. Um, as X is go, square is break, circle is handbrake, so triangle probably. I think the the left and right, um, L2 and R2 are kind of look left and right, and you hold both of them to look behind. A little bit awkward way of looking behind, so I'm going to guess, yeah, triangle is probably going to be the uh, the one for action, unless it, uh, unless it tells me otherwise. Uh, ooh, come back here, Van. To be fair, I should have the advantage here in terms of speed. Uh, oh crap! Where are we going? Although he has the advantage of knowing where he where he is going. Boxes! Woohoo! Uh, <laughs> they, they do love their. Uh, ooh, they do love their boxes. Van, come back here! Like I've been. Um, I'm assuming we're going to follow the tire marks. That's what to do here. Oh, here we go! I got through some more boxes. Oh crap! We didn't dodge the forklift. We rolled. Car down. Car down, big time. Uh, Into the excuse warehouse. me, Van. The if you could, if you could give me a, a second, I could do with. Um, I could do with you waiting up for me Under because the there. Oh, there has there has been some small bumpings. We've been with quite small bumpings. I've taken the ladder with me. The ladder's coming. Okay. Uh, where are we going? But <laughs> I don't know where we're going. <laughs> oh dear, that one there didn't quite. We we got a little bit screwed over by the forklift kind of just rolled us and then it was all really downhill from there i think what we're going to do is take that jump and kind of aim the car to the left take two. We, we aim to the left we should be good to clear the, the to clear the forklift get the car back on the ground and then proceed to uh, to give chase like this van has got a huge advantage to us like he, he doesn't have to go through any of the ridiculous stuff uh, <laughs> and uh, i'm having to kind of launch my car through containers and God only knows what else it's going to be doing. Jump right, okay. More boxes! Destruction uh, around the, the corner. There we go. Oh, hello. Ah, I may have met the truck head on. Let's go, let's go again. On, a, on that one. Um, okay, we've got a... I, to be fair, I could probably go to the left of the first truck if I think about it and kind of position myself right. Uh, or position myself left, Take technically. Three. But you know what I mean. If I, if I get my car in the right position coming around that corner, I could probably stay to... The, uh, the left hand side of the first truck and then get the, the B close to the truck uh, bit if I man. wanted to or just take the line that you're kind of supposed to. Uh, I am trying to stay close to the van. Uh, right, now we will get in here and then come Jump on, find the a gear, find some go, find some go. There we go. Oh no, that's a little bit too much get go. Uh, 
There's a little bit of a, a little bit of a almost roll through that part. Oh, right now we're gonna have to turn around here. Okay, we're going up the ramp, aren't we? Yeah, up the platform. This is the one we crashed into the boxes. I, I dodged the forklift, but I might have dodged him a little too well. But there we go. Uh, we have to get close to the forklift, but uh, oh well, never mind. Gap will appear there and hopefully remain there. Uh, oh, we're around here. No, oh, damn it, I've not got. <laughs> <laughs> Not got that sorted. Oh, I think with my boss and powers, we'd ever so slightly. Go, car, go. Under the ladder, just about. Uh, I think I'm too far back. Yeah, okay, so it kind of lets me get to that stage, but um, if you're too far back, it's going to fail you anyway. Okay. I've got to get that turn right. That turn is really awkward. I kind of want to... I think what I'm doing is I would know I want to be to the left to go under the ladder, and I'm kind of Rolling. not uh, turning enough really i'm running too close to the wall clipping the front corner on on that so let's try and not uh, have that same mistake so we can get a little oh okay that was a big oversteering moment that i wasn't quite expecting but never mind oh come on come on car uh, <laughs> i am struggling slightly with uh, with this control unfortunately it doesn't let me change the controls to uh, be one of the button or one of the left and right buttons uh, that i would be used to using for for driving games uh, so yeah, I'm kind of stuck with a slightly dodgy X button here. Uh, right, we're going through some more of this stuff here. We fly through the air and hit that. Get close to the forklift. Uh, oh no, that's a big one. That was a very big accident. Um, <laughs> how many of these have I gone through now? I might be better off. As my, I know it wants me... I don't know if I got clipped by the forklift. I know it wants me to go near the forklift. I might just be better off not doing that one. I know I won't get the 100% score, but um, that Rolling. bit seems to be screwing me over quite a, quite a lot. The uh, these these kind of sequences, they do kind of ask you to do quite a lot in one go. So when there's like that, for example, that forklift stun, it is a little bit of a bugger. You have to actually redo the entire, I say the entire thing. They're not too long, uh, too long or a stun, so it doesn't get too bad. Uh, at least certainly these early ones. I don't know what it gets like further on if there are some arsey ones or not, really. Um, we will have to, we'll have to wait and see, possibly. Uh, I hope that was close enough to the truck. I think it was. Uh, right. Oh, no need to be sliding around that corner there. We're going to go through the roadworks. We're going to hit that. And we're going to dodge the forklift or not dodge the forklift. Oh, dear. Van, I can see you over there. Okay, right. I didn't do... <laughs> I didn't do what I said I was going to do, basically. <laughs> Bugger. Never a good idea. Right. We will get it right this time. This is the one, okay? I hope. I, I really I really do quite hope. Uh, <laughs> right. Keep the mashing man. the X button and make sure that it's, uh, my finger doesn't slightly slip off. The buttons on these old PS2 controllers, I believe, are supposed to be slightly uh, pressure sensitive, but this controller is dodgy as hell, so... It's not really. It's kind of make sure you mash it, otherwise it might not be uh, quite working. I don't quite know what's going on with the gearing around here. The, the driver is not doing a very good job with the gearing. E okay, right. Through the boxes. Now we've got to go close to the truck. We are close to the truck there. Nicely. Right, this is the bogey stunt. This is the bogey stunt. The horrible, horrible forklift truck. Uh, through the boxes. Uh, dodge the forklift. Oh, we dodged the forklift nicely. Uh-oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're good. We're, we're not good. There's been a small accident. Okay, there has been a small... <laughs> I have a feeling that uh, even if we get around here, it's going to do exactly the same as it's done the previous ones. You are too slow. Uh, oh, no, it didn't. I was just expecting it to fail me as I went around the corner and plowed straight into the fence. <laughs> Okay, so we can get away with tumbling end over end and landing almost, very almost, in the water. But, uh, yeah, the, the getting it stuck in the wall kind of... I think perhaps it holds the van until uh, until a point, and if you crash coming towards the ladder, uh, the van get, kind of gets released uh, before then, so you're too far back, if that makes sense. But you can crash at the jump, and it's fine with that, and uh, it'll, do, it'll be a little bit of... Um, uh, a little bit of camera editing, shall we say. Camera editing, film editing, whatever. Uh, <laughs> to, to make it look alright. I don't quite know. I, I kind of want one of these ones with the huge accidents to uh, be the, the completed run. Just because I want to see the silly continuity that will probably go on with the final footage. Just, ah oh yes, that car that was barrel rolling through the air about five times and almost ended up in the water. Oh yeah, that's fine. Right, there we go. 
There's a two. Oh, land it. There we go. See, we're still good. We're still perfectly, perfectly drivable. Uh, we did get the uh, dodge the forklift, at least. Right, we've dodged the that. We haven't dodged the, the ladder. I've not done a very good job there. Van! Hello. Uh, I don't know what cannon roll is. <laughs> I mashed buttons and it didn't work. Oh, for God's sake. I did try that one. Um... Okay, I might have to have a sneaky look up the controls because I mashed what I thought was going to be the button and it didn't do anything. Uh, either that or I've timed it wrong, possibly. I mean, couldn't you just had use that, that final shot there? Uh, set up, have we got... Um, no, we haven't. Okay, that's fun. Uh, right. Well, I guess it could be uh, L1 as well. That might be the other possibility of... Uh, <laughs> Right, so when we get to that bit, it's literally, we're right at the very end of, of this one. I can do the rest of it, it's just, uh, when we get to that final sector, we're gonna mash L1 and Triangle, and hopefully one of them will work. That was a little bit of chonky driving from me, but never mind. Right, we are across there, oh, hello van. Uh, we're losing the truck. I think I might have missed the van ever so slightly. Yes, I did. Okay, this one here is all sorts of wobbly. Never mind. Uh, close to that. Hit that. Jump off here. Oh, no. I, I think... I think I might have to be... I think I'm supposed to jump straight as opposed to what I'm doing, which is kind of jumping at a slight angle uh, to avoid the forklift. Uh, yeah, I think I'm supposed to, to be jumping straight there. Right. Okay, here we go. This is the one. Um, and cut. <laughs> I, don't, I wouldn't really say that was a cannon roll. It was a a bump of, of sorts. There was an explosion. I still, I, I'm guessing then it might have been L1 that was the, the right button to press. Um, well, I mean, it kind of did a thing. Have we not quite finished the movie yet? Oh, I was hoping I could get through the, get through the movie and see the end bit. Um... Have we got any more else? What more stunts could we have possibly to do in this? We've wrecked so many cars. The uh, <laughs> the studio is not going to be happy with the amount of cars that we've gone through. I mean, the, how many tumbles we did in that one, I don't know. Uh, so yeah, maybe they could fix them up and, and send them out again. I just want to see the, the, the finished thing now with all of the silly shenanigans that uh, I managed to do partway through it. Being us is what's letting us down. Two. I don't like Rogers and I don't like milky tea. Well, I ain't in it for the money. I'm in it to scare people and say cool stuff and the money. I tell you, it's easy as chip shop scene. Nothing's gonna go wrong. I should... They really do love their exploding boxes. Take on the gangster who already wants them dead. I oh, don't forget, I can do two things. I get rich, then I get angry. Also, I'm not sure hammers are the best tools to get into the same. We ain't exactly this flavour of the mouth. Toothless in what? It was the worst cannon roll of all time, I think. Spectacular! Oh, we didn't get to see the police car putting the other vehicle in the water. Uh, Disappointing. So this behind me is the stunt arena where I do a bit of work between movie contracts. It's a place where I can sharpen up on some skills and learn a few new ones. Plus it keeps me busy in the blood pumping. I'm gonna have to shoot, I got a show tonight. Hey, well that was the uh, the movie done. Uh, I guess we have kind of these intervals between between the different films, just the, the, the stunt show that you do, all sorts of random crazy crap. Uh, we will uh, yeah, maybe we'll pick this up later. Um, if you guys like to see me do some more on this game, I may take a look at some of the other the other game modes. Maybe continue with the the career mode. Uh, might have to find a better controller, but uh, yeah, might possibly continue with that. If if people are interested, uh, it's been a very very enjoyable game. Got to say, this one it has been uh, it's been very good fun uh, playing it. It's a little bit easier than I remember. I, I do seem to remember getting a lot more frustrated with this uh, with the, with the demo. It may well get a lot arsier later on as I uh, as I play through it. Um, but uh, yeah, that is 
going to be it for this video. I'll have one attempt at whatever on earth we're going to be doing here, which by the looks of it is soaring through the air and either crashing into a pile of cars or trying to jump over a pile of cars. Um, or I'm going to try and com jump, sort of complete like a jump through a fi fiery hoop and then complete a jump through some cars. And oh, look at that. Now we're breaking some more things. And now we're going to go through a tunnel and into a pile of cars. Woohoo! Okay. We did it! <laughs> um, yeah, there you go. That was it for a look at uh, Stuntman. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time, uh, goodbye.